What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can decrease your input delay and get a boost in FPS once again. Now I do want to say I appreciate you guys for the support because the support you guys have been giving me has been crazy lately and I really appreciate it guys. Thank you guys so much for the support you've been giving me on this channel. Also I do want to say that I apologize for not uploading. I have been busy you know doing schoolwork and stuff like that and I haven't had much time to be able to record for you guys but um yeah i just wanted to put that out there so you guys are not confused on why i haven't been uploading but um yeah i will be posting a lot moving forward so do not worry guys i will be posting more frequently i just you know how to take some time off for uh schoolwork and stuff like that but anyways um let's get straight to the video okay guys so what you guys first want to do is go to your search bar or whatever icon down here you got and then you want to search command prompt and make sure you run it as administrator like guys i'm about to do once it is opened, you guys want to type in SFC slash scan now. I will have this in the description for you guys, but basically what this will do is scan your computer and they'll see if there's any errors going on in your computer or corruption. And basically if there's corruption, this could be the reason why your FPS is low or giving you input delay and this will give you less input delay and better FPS basically. But yeah, um, I'll be back when it's finished. So as you guys see, I had no corruption and I scanned my computer already. So that's the reason why I don't have any corruption. But you guys might have corruptions and it will explain what type of corruptions are on your computer. Basically, this would fix it. And uh, yeah, after you do this tweak, you might see a boost in FPS and lower input delay. But um, yeah, let's get to the next tweak. Alright guys, so for this next week, what you guys want to do is open up your registry editor. Basically, if you don't have it in a taskbar like me, just go to your search bar, registry, it's right there. And once you have it open, you won't be greeted with what I'm at right now because this is in the description. So basically, just copy this from the description. I will be putting it in the, in the description for you guys. So you just copy this and then you go up here, paste it, press enter, and you will be right here. Now, what you guys want to do is check these folders, right? and you should see like right here how it says my gp right here your main gpu will be right here you see the name of it once you have go to the folder to see your gpu name right here just right click well before you do that actually make sure you go to the description and copy this and then press new right click new d word 32 bit and then paste the name press enter and then basically you should have it like this how i have it right here just want to double click it and press one type in one and press ok make sure it's on hexadecimal two once you have that you know at one you want to restart your computer and what this will do is lower your input delay in fortnite or anything you do on your computer basically it will make your you know game smoother anyways off to the next week all right guys so for this next week i'm going to show you guys how to get low quality in fortnite just basically worse graphics this can improve your delay in fps depending on what you play on um I'm going to be putting three options on screen, low, ultra low, and very low. Now, these settings vary on what you want to use. It depends on what you want to use. But in this video, I'm going to be showing ultra. So basically for ultra, what you guys want to do is just open up profile inspector. And then you guys want to go to where it says transparency subsampling. Now you want to put this on AA mode, replay mode all. And then you want to scroll down to where you see LOD bias OGL. Now what you want to do is put this all the way to the max like I have right here. And then where you see negative LOD bias, you just want to put that on clamp. Now this will make your graphics really bad or not really bad, but just you no know, worse than what they are in Fortnite. And if you guys want gameplay of it, I'll be putting it up, up on screen right now. Alright guys, so for this next tweak, what you guys want to do is go to my description. I will be putting a link in the description for you guys to get to this website. Basically, all you want to do on this website is scroll down until you see filters key setter 1.0 zip. You want to click on this one. Basically, once you have downloaded it, you want to double click it or whatever on your downloads. Just 
press extract to press ok and if you don't have this program i will be putting this in the link in the description too it's called winwar uh, but basically whenever you open up zip files you could just double tap it and then you press extract to press ok but anyways once you guys have done that you just double click on that and it would open this program now once this program is open what you guys want to do is disable the rest of these right here as i'm doing you want to enable this enable this and this and then basically once you have all of that enabled you want to come to the left side make sure this is at zero put this at 150 and then put this at 25 and then press ok and what this will do is this will lower your input delay and increase your edit speed on fortnite for all you low end pc players or whoever you guys have whatever your pcs you guys have if you guys have input delay this will fix it but yeah all right guys so if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and hit the like bell make sure to hit the notification bell if you guys want to see more tweets coming up i will be posting a lot more i'm sorry that i haven't been posting a lot but uh, i also want to say merry christmas um i forgot to say it in the intro but i really hope you guys you know spend time with your families and have a good christmas i hope your day was good and um yeah peace out